Hello lovely people, I've got a book to read today and I was wondering if you would help me get through it because I don't know if I'm brave enough to read it all the way to the end. It's the scariest monster in the world! Will you help me read it? Oh, thank you. Oh. Once there was a very scary monster. His fur was wild and weird and carried a giant club with bristles on it and his teeth were green and mossy because he never ever brushed his teeth. He stomped through the forest and shouted, get out of my way! The other animals ran whenever they saw him coming. I'm the scariest monster in the world, the monster proudly said. But then one day, Hick! Who made that noise? He came again, Hick! And again, Hick! 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 Oh no, it was him! Hick! Go away, shouted the monster. Everybody always did what he said when he shouted, but the hiccups didn't seem to know that. Hick! What am I going to do? Hick! Do! Hick! moaned the monster. He tried burying his head under his pillow, which was crusty and smelly because he never washed it. He tried running in circles. He even tried swinging upside down like bats. Hick! Hick! Finally, the monster sat down and began to cry. The animals crept out of their hiding places. Why is he crying? They whispered. Hick! groaned the monster. I've got the hiccups and they won't go away. But hiccups are easy to cure, said the clever old crow. Really? Tell me how, begged the monster. Just stand on your head and drink a glass of water, said the crow. But it's hard to drink when you're the wrong side up. Uck, spluttered the monster. I'm hick drowning. That didn't hick work at all, said the monster sadly. Try holding your breath, said the crow. Hold it for as long as you can. Whoosh, the monster took a big, deep breath. <gasps> mm -hmm. He said, flailing his arms. Don't give up, squeaked the mice. The monster felt dizzy. He staggered in circles. Thump! He's not hiccuping anymore, whispered one of the mice. The monster sat up. He blinked. They're gone, he cried! The hiccups are hic There's one thing left, said the crow. We'll have to scare them out of you. The animals tried everything they could to think of to scare the monster. The fox made loud noises behind his back. The mice made horrible hisses and jumped out at him. The owl told him creepy stories about ghosts. Hick! The animals thought and thought. What could be scary enough to frighten the scariest monster in the world? I've got it, shouted the crow. Close your eyes. It was very dark with his eyes closed. The monster waited and hiccuped and hiccuped and waited. This is silly, he thought impatiently. They can't scare me. Look, said the crow. The monster opened his eyes and... Eek! He screamed. Standing before him was a terrible monster. It had wild, weird fur and a giant club with bristles and green, mossy teeth. Take it away, shrieked the monster. It's you! laughed the crow. You frightened the hiccups right out of yourself. It was true. The hiccups were really gone. Hurrah! said the monster. The animal started to slip away. Where are you going? called the monster. You're back to normal now, said the crow. That means you'll soon be scaring us again. The monster thought about how the other animals had helped him. Don't go, he pleaded. I don't want to be the scariest monster in the world anymore. So he asked the rabbits to help him groom his fur. And he gave away his giant club with the bristles on it. And he even brushed his teeth. Now, whenever someone in the forest gets the hiccups, 
all they have to do is ask the monster to come and scare them away. The monster always does because he can still look very, very scary when he tries. But everyone knows he's just pretending. The end. Oh, what a lovely story. And I got to the end and it wasn't as scary as I thought it was going to be. And in the end, he looked in the mirror and scared himself. How funny is that? I hope you enjoyed the story. It was by Lee Weatherly and Agley Craig Hall. One of my favourites that I found in my cupboards. Hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. See you again soon. Bye.